We got another one? Just when you ran out of luck with that one, you got another one here. Hey, that's that 77 Corvette. All right. So what you got here, Duncan? A little 383 stroking. Blueprint racing, huh? Yes, sir. Yeah, as I recall, this guy liked uh, a blackout theme. That's why, and I love this one. This is another one that we always use CVF racing religiously. Uh, Corey, uh, Eric, um, Derek, I also think, over at CVF. Um, hey, I'm Jim. I'm the guy that buys a bunch of these things from you. So, anyways, representing in the house, CVF racing. It's either bling or it's the blackout with the reveal ball mill. What a nice unit. Seven rib belt, 150 amp alternator, the GM Type 2 mini high output um, power steering pump. There's a valve in here that we usually change and minimize for the Ford applications. Has the crank, the idler pulleys, the tensioner pulley, sand and seven, a peanut style AC pump, aluminum high flow reverse water pump. I mean, the only difference between Ford, Chevy, Chrysler is this bracket right here. These components are all the same. 383 stroker, blueprint racing, and these things are a dream. I've bought dozens of them over the years. But anyways, this is his final home. And wait, what do we have here? This sucker's expensive, but this is, this is gonna keep this engine cool. And when he's uh, got his foot to the ground, his pedal on the metal, or metal to the pedal, whatever. And we've got all this cleaned up and restored. We also have a new brake system going in. So, 77 Corvette is getting a new heart transplant. And yeah, can't wait. Hey, you know what? And uh, for those of you that were interested, this is our 66 Resto Mod. Now that she's down on the ground. Ooh, look at her. Look at that. Look at that. 347 stroker. Woo wee. See? Now this is um vintage air. This is more pricey. Bought this uh, like I said, God, this thing is probably within a decade old. Been sitting, just got a cleaner off. 347 engine uh, stroker, blueprint, also blueprint racing engine. This is one of the last Endura Shine finish before the Edelbrock group um, went out from their own and and, and became the Edelbrock group, group. And that was right after Vic Edelbrock Sr. died and uh, they stopped offering that uh, that plating. It's basically a three-stage, uh, uh, like a mirror finish type of plating to give you that chrome look. There's those stripes. There's the hood. Look at that. Just gorgeous. Beautiful. And unfortunately, like I said before, we can't, uh, we're not going to be able to get her running ourselves. It's just because of budgets. And look at those wheels. Custom. Hey, Tracy, thanks again. Wheel pros. Neato tires. And. We have a gauge cluster somewhere. That thing is bad A, beautiful. And it, it escapes me at the moment. But anyways, 66 Mustang Fastback, Hertz Rent-A-Car, Restomod. Just beautiful. Look at her. Woo wee. God, one way or another, I will get behind the wheel of this car okay you hear me ed i deserve it hey thanks again i'm jim jim speed shop you're watching american garage tv thanks for tuning in we'll see you on the next video thanks for watching Woo -wee. look at her anyways this is a 383 stroker from Blueprint Racing Engines. Andrew, if you're out there listening, thank you very much for your support, your wonderful support. We bought a lot of these over the years. Um, the kit here came up on ATEC. That's our wholesale division of Summit Racing. 
came up a 10 spline, but yet when we took that out, it happened to be a 26 spline. Now, our information is only as good as what they supply. So, at the time we started ordering parts before we actually took it apart. So, it happens sometimes. So, we just ended up buying um, a different clutch, a 26 spline clutch. Uh, we got what's known as the 500 series from McLeod. Uh, it's going to be perfect for the horsepower and torque output of this motor and basically street performance. It's not going to be drag racing. They do have a 600 series and then of course they have a basic, uh, I guess, uh, economy or whatever you say, stock. And this car ain't going to be stock anymore. So we are sending her home once again blueprint racing 383 stroker and this is his i guess you could say theme or color selection it's the cvf racing again cvf racing the black with the ball mill and it's kind of a satin finish and you know the reveal here the aluminum and then those valve covers, got to represent Chevrolet. We got something that was a little more Whoa. nostalgic as far as the font. So, anyways, we're going to drop this baby home and um, we're going to get her on the road sometime soon. So again, thanks for tuning in. See you next time.